Hey fam, we just got back from the beach. The girls and I went to the beach this morning with our friends. And she has two kids as well, so we went, we just agreed to go to the beach and we went early, which was really fun because not a lot of people were there. That was a great experience for us. I don't want to change. Zoe doesn't want to change from her cute little swimsuit. You like, did you enjoy the beach, Zozo? Mm -hmm. Was it fun? Very nice. Yeah, her swimsuit is adorable. You ha how's the beach? Oh, it's pretty good. <laughs> it was fun. Was yeah, fun. it was fun. Look at her bathing suit. Mixed bathing suit's really cute. We were chasing, not halfway through, the whole time basically everyone and I were chasing these little minnows like this thing. Yeah. And then at one point we went further out and we saw like this big minnow. It was like this big. Was it it's called a minnow? Is that big? It, it looked the exact same as the other fish though. Oh wow. Like it was just like huge. Yeah, but it's kind of funny because 10 minutes before that, this woman that I was talking to, she was telling me that when she, like every time she comes here now, they mm -hmm. find these big fish, huge fish mm -hmm. swimming around. And it swims around the shallow part and I was like, oh, that's kind of cool. But then we're, we were both thinking, we're like, oh, that's kind of concerning. Like why is that even happening? Well, yeah, what is, I was telling <laughs> Gabrielle, I was like, like now the big fish scares me. And she's like, really? And I was like, not really, no. Like, the beach was so fun. Yeah, we were the first, one of five families there, so it was really, really good. And when we were leaving is when everyone was starting to come. And I was like, <laughs> we uh, missed us. <laughs> Anyways, now we're back home. I'm so hungry, but I still am fasting for another hour. And then Mick's got to go to work soon. But I'm just going to make myself some tea. I've been on this tea kick of just having like, it's like Tetley with a little bit of milk. Because when you're fasting, Apparently you can have like 50 you can have like a tiny tiny amount of milk in it that it shouldn't cause It to break your fast. So that's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm not in I'm definitely not in ketosis I can tell but I've noticed like my body looks drastically different because this bathing suit I have a clip of me trying it on maybe a year ago and it fits so different and then all of a sudden today i'm like oh my goodness like it looks it's like night and day so if i can find the picture i'll put it side by side so you guys can see it but i'm like really impressed though like i said the number on the scale hasn't changed but i also started going back to the gym two days ago or three days ago because i went the day before yesterday and then i took a break the day uh, the day in between and then i went yesterday and i think i might try to go today we'll see i'm trying to ease my way into it but i feel so good being back it's helping to de-stress I have hopes 
weeks now <laughs> to transform my body back the way I want it to be and just get healthy and fit, you know, because carrying your postpartum weight for like two years after having a giving birth, it's not always fun, but it just kind of, not everyone bounces back really quickly. Not everyone's body is designed the same. Some of us have to work super hard just to get it back close to what it was because I don't know if it ever entirely goes back to where it was. So. <laughs> Also, the sunscreen that I wore today said it like it was a nice sunscreen. I'm not supposed to look like this. I looked hecka ashy on the street. Why do I look so ashy? Like the sunscreen I pay. This is a, this is like a a very pricey sunscreen. It's so expensive, and it's not supposed to have me looking ashy. And the whole time I was out, I was looking so ashy. It was not a good look. So that's a no for me. I honestly might have to look into this whole black girl sunscreen thing that I've seen. I know it's there, but it's not like I'm in Canada. We don't have it in. We're not in the U.S. So I just. I can't, haven't gotten my hands on it because I haven't seen it in any stores anywhere. I've seen it online, but I would have to pay basically like I think double the price or something like that. I don't know. I have to look again. And now things have also gone up, so who knows? But it, at, the, at any rate, I'm pretty sure it's more than worth it because the one that I'm using is like a pretty penny. Like we're talking like one bill. Um, you know, so yeah, and that's ridiculous. Like if I'm going to be wearing like super expensive sunscreen that's supposed to be blocking sun, how is it going to do that and cast me and have me looking super ashy on the street? No, ma'am. And how's it going? It's pretty good. Yeah? Let's see. I'm back Getting your hands in there. Are you having fun as well? Yes. Yeah? Dumplings are good. Dumplings are very fun. Are you helping to make them? Are you reading the instructions right now? Yeah. Hey fam, Sarah here and Charlotte. We just got back after dropping Mick to work just now. But before we left, Gabrielle was making fried dumplings. Did you try any? Oh, me? Did you try some? Uh, I had like a little piece. Ah. It's good, no, it's good. <laughs> so you only had two dumplings. Oh, yeah. You only had two dumplings. Like, what the heck happened? To be fair, these are, I was eating some. Oh, y'all eat yeah. some? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I'm the I'm the guest. Okay, I'm not really a guest, but you just took one. that was the best one. <laughs> okay, so from last night, Gabrielle told Zoe that she was gonna make dumplings, and Gabrielle Zoe woke up this morning. The first thing she said to me was, "We're gonna make dumplings," <laughs> and she was so excited. Yeah, so she's and making I was it with. Too. Huh? I was excited too. Yeah, so Gabrielle um, made dumplings, but what recipe did you follow? She's not following like a, like a family recipe. You should have called Grandma. Oh, yeah, shut up, call Grandma. No, the grandma, forgive me. And <laughs> is that she followed the recipe off YouTube, and this one did call for sugar, so she added sugar to it, and right away, they've already tried it, and they said it tastes different. But looking at it, obviously, it's, she needs to work on the shape a little bit because yeah. she hasn't made dumpling very frequent, and it takes practice to make sure to get it rounded. So anyway, Charlotte and I are gonna try it real quick. So Zoe's in on it because Zoe helped to make the dumpling. Did you help to make it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What was your impression? Okay, I'm gonna try it. Mmm. It's tasty. Mmm, it's pretty good. It's pretty tasty. Very good. <laughs> So guys, this is me in the future, way, way, way in the future because for some reason or another this vlog, I couldn't find the ending for it. This is what happens when your vlog is backed up. But anyways, long story short, dumplings turned out good. Definitely not the recipe that we're used to eating. It's a little bit on the sweeter side, but they were good nonetheless. Um, I'm so grateful to have bigger kids who are willing to do projects and little activities with our younger ones which was really really good so um zoe enjoyed that a lot spending time with her big sister and i told gabrielle i appreciated her and i just appreciated what she did very very much so yeah that's pretty much um it for today's vlog uh i don't know what what today's vlog is but it's on the shorter side but hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless i'm trying to organize my vlogs in a strategic manner 
so they're not all over the place but topic can just stay on topic throughout the whole vlog i'm hoping that's what i'm trying to do for the near future so if you see others that are kind of like still on the same wavelength as of now don't don't be um don't be like sarah like i thought you said because like it just takes time but hope you guys enjoyed today's video thank you so much for tuning in and i'll uh, see you on the next see you in the next one by the way when you see me my hair is not going to be like this for a few vlogs ahead <laughs> because like i said this is my future i'm inserting my future self into these into today's video so i hope it doesn't throw everything off but you know anything for you guys because i just didn't want you to feel like at the end of the day i didn't even close the vlog properly and say thank you for showing up and thank you for watching it and if you made it all the way through i appreciate you so 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 much thank you so much guys and until next time much love.